Tom. along there, right? Everybody's okay with that. Now, okay, that's that contact. Where do we see it over there? On this side, right? Now, look across. If we look this way, I see this light-colored sand bed goes down to the road. And there's another light-colored sand bed. Is that the same sand bed? Uh-huh. Somebody says no, somebody says yes. Somebody, who said yes, say why? Bold, okay. You, that's, that's a good hypothesis. So how did you draw your contact that connects between here and there? That's what you'd have to do, just what you did. In your hypothesis, a very good point, it would turn, right? <laughs> yeah, this is basically one big the, incline. If, if for the contact, it would turn and come around, what would have to happen for the for the orientations of bits? They would have to. They would also have to curve, oh, right? Oh, standing up now. So they'd have to curve and then come back for that to work. How do we know? We don't know. It's covered under dirt, right? Uh -huh. Under road. Now, who said the sandstone bed? Was the same, or did we do that? Who said that? Somebody said no. Then who said? Who said no? I just thought there was another layer on top of it. You're right. There's another layer layer to the right of it over there, right? There's another sand bed. Brownish. Here. Something. Is there a sand bed there? Nope. Hmm. Classic case of missed correlation. It's very tempting because the color of this is the same as the color of that. But just your eye goes straight across, says, oh, that's the same bed. Done. No problem. And then it goes into that. This is what I would have done too, but I just didn't care and then think about it. But notice where the contact is, and now notice where the bed is. So what's the alternative? Where is this bed over there? Then? There it is. Oh, it's all shifted. Yeah. That's over there, right? I saw somebody, yeah. yeah. That one right there that's forming that little ridge that we were all looking at on the slope. Mm -hmm, right so here it makes a ridge, and there it makes a ridge. Now, how come it's over there, here, and over here, here? This contact's going right there, that contact's going right there. That Fault? Yes. It's another type of geologic contact. Because the geologic units, what kind of contact is this one between the Messina Valley and the Capra? What do you call that class? What are these? Depositional contact. But as I go this way, there's a rock boundary between that body of rock and this body of rock that is under the road that separates this rock unit from that rock unit over there. That makes fault contact. Fault runs down along the road and shifts everything. Now, is that a solid line for that fault? Would that be a solid line contact, a dashed line contact, or a dotted? Who's going to be dotted? Because it's called a continuous. 